Okay, so there it is. That window is in. Tomorrow I will cut the C3 and uh, weld that panel that goes here, which will be the same size as this. And uh, uh, today is Tuesday. I'll make that Wednesday and Thursday. Uh, unless something happens, I'll start cutting that window there. So that can be put in before the chickens get here. <clears throat> the other thing is, is uh, put in this door. Now this door here, uh, got it for the right price. It's bigger than this opening and it cannot be trimmed. So I welded uh, uh, a little piece of angle iron to install the hinges. And then put in this little latch here. And it works pretty good. It's have to put some trim on this side to uh, height this opening here because I didn't want to use the angle iron from top to bottom so I'll just put a little bit of wooden trim here going up and it'll be good enough now this window here as you can see this is a little bit sticking out and uh, that was because this window came from a different wall that happened to be a little thicker. So, yeah. So after all the windows are done, the four windows, and I uh, put cement all the way around on all the windows, Yeah, put some cement in there and kind of angle it down or something and it'll be okay. It's just uh, the chicken coop, so it'll work out. Yeah, as you can see, need some uh, cement there. definitely need some cement there but that whole section had to come off because being so small uh, the gap being so small it just wouldn't stay up there but uh, yeah I'll take that block off when it's time to put that cement in there as you can see going down the bottom there yeah Okay, so anyway, there it is. Slowly but surely, getting things done. And uh, I want to do this before the chickens get here, like I said. And uh, then go from there. Okay. Okay, guys. Good morning. So here we are on the last window. And as you can see, there's lines there, and there's lines there, and then this will go up right below this metal and come across. It'll be just like this one here. As you can see, the window is right below the metal, and all that cement had to come out because there's not much there. Uh, for it to stay there so yeah today is Thursday from the conversation well from the message that was sent uh, before 
three weeks ago. Uh, Monday, Tuesday, they should uh, start heading out this way. And it takes them four or five days to make deliveries all the way down here. So we'll find out if it's true. Here is the little window panel that's going to go here. So as you can guess, I am going to be cutting into this wall today. I need to get this done because if they come next week, this needs to be done. Like I said before, the filling in the cement could be done at any time. For example, there, there, you know, all that kind of stuff. Yeah, so all that kind of stuff will get filled in at a later time and we can have chickens and what have you and it's, it'll be okay. It'll be no problem. Let me get busy. Let me finish marking this window. I need to put a line on the very top up here. And uh, I need to get the ladder and get up there. And then I will sit for a little bit, drink a cup of coffee. And then get to it because I want to do it all at one time. It's a very dusty type of operation, so I want to get it done. All right. I'll show you as I go. Okay, so there we are. Just in the nick of time, got the window to the feed room, the door to the feed room, the window to the rabbit room, and the two windows to the chicken coop, the automatic uh, water feeders are running, the tank that supplies the water to them. Fills up, shuts off everything correctly. So that's good. Right now, the. Uh... Thanks for watching. See you next time. See you. Bye bye.